The launch of Guy Drones comes after years of talks at the government and private sector levels on how drone technology can substitute dwindling manpower in not only the agriculture sector but also construction and oil and gas. Chief Executive Officer of Guy Drones, Rani Rama, said although the company was started abroad, she and her husband, Irshad Mohammed, as Vice President of Operations, have always had Guyana at heart. She said the technology has already proven successful in the United States of America and Canada and believes it will serve the local market well. We have brought to Guyana a technology that is already very successful in Canada and the U.S. Our company will be creating employment, providing training, and reducing costs in many sectors while providing productivity and efficiency, improving. We've already partnered with other service providers right here in Guyana and internationally to further widen our scope. Mohamed, who is a pilot and worked for several years with drone technology, said he was excited about the prospects. Using the Agris T20 and the P4 multi-speed, he said the company will begin by offering a range of services in the agriculture sector. These include cross-monitoring, surveying, data mapping, environmental monitoring and prospecting. He said among the major advantages of using drone technology in agriculture are greater efficiency and less cost. The multispectral drone, what it does it goes into the field and it scans it. It has an infrared six-band camera that all the indices that you, you wish to have um, being a farmer. Tells you the pH level, tells you nitrogen, also tells you the, the content of the soil. With that, the farmers are able to have data and we can able to analyze using the, the T20 we can do um, Spot spraying. What is spot spraying? Rather than broadcasting, we use a drone to do spot spraying. Farmers are able to save money. The objective here is, is to allow farmers to save money and give them, provide them with enough data that they can do proper planning. The launch of the company received the full endorsement of the government with George Jarvis as a technical officer at the Ministry of Agriculture committing the ministry's full support. He said with reduced ambition pushing people to work in the agriculture sector, the introduction of this type of technology to ensure precise mechanized agriculture was important. The company also received the endorsement of head of GoInvest, Peter Ransarup. In recent months, Guy Drones has gained increasing traction in the Guyana agriculture market. Innovative precision agriculture technology is being increasingly adopted throughout Guyana farms and Guy Drones is at the forefront of service in this market with aerial surveying, data collection and analysis. Guy Drones is currently looking to hire motivated, energetic team members to help it remotely piloted aircraft systems.